Hi, let's welcome you to the new course of C Sharp Programming Language, a beginner to an expert uh, course. So it is a uh, unlike and like similar languages such as Java, C++. C Sharp is being used is being widely used in the programming world, and it was created by the uh, Microsoft. And what does it means that it's a modern primary language so what does it mean that it will contain some libraries it has object oriented priming function if we can use or we can develop some desktop application with the help of c -Sharp, we can use or we can develop some backend apis with the help of uh, c -Sharp and so on and so forth it runs on the dotnet core uh, framework and it is very close to c and c++ uh, and java primary languages and what does it means that the overall hierarchy and the overall condition where the C and C++ and the Java application work are being much similar to when we compare to C sharp with the other programming languages so C sharp if I know the basics of C and C++ or Java I can easily reflect back and I can easily translate I can easily migrate towards C sharp in a more uh, efficient number of times and uh, in a more uh, fruitful way so it was developed for by Anders Heidsberg and with and his team and it is now being applicable or it is now being accepted by the international standard organization which is ISO the overall the the mature version was being released and the release the latest version is 8.0 and it was released in September 2019 we use this with a visual studio uh, code id uh, so that we can run these application and in a more uh, fruitful in a more easier way so we have some of the strong primary features of c sharp and it does it that it follows the tradition high level languages and just like the object oriented programming it is being similar towards the uh, C and C++ and with that uh, with that happens we can easily migrate towards the C sharp in no matter time and it has the strong uh, resemblance with the uh, Java, with Java and it contains some numerous uh, strong programming features that makes it popular in the uh, overall in the overall world and it still it is being used for some of the backend application and to write some of the API to write to fetch some of the data to to develop a logic uh, and to connect the front end the back end C sharp is so much widely is being used so we have some of the few important features of C sharp and it is being boolean conditions we can have true and false and it has the automatic garbage collection the standard libraries we have many libraries in C sharp to to play with the strings to play with arrays and to to make uh, to make GUI graphical user interfaces and the web application so we have with the help of libraries we can easily use those functions in those libraries and we can take our work out then we can have a simple multi threading the, the it can happen that if I need to run a program uh, in in multi threads uh, so that my program can be faster so I can use the help of multi threading then we can have the indexers also the delegates and the event management that all those things and that this this thing is being clicked the mouse is being clicking over an icon and an event is being occurred so this event management is being, is being done and it is being available for the integration with the window so we have many events uh, or we can have many features in uh, c sharp primary language which we will be having a uh, go through in overall module of this um, in, in this overall uh, course and this is a bit introduction it is being widely used and now the if we consider Java and C sharp the sh now at this at 2023 we still see that C sharp fresh graduates are being hiring or C sharp one or two years of experience uh, programmers are being hired so it is a demanding skill and we need to focus over the basics of C sharp so that we can excel in this and we can make application be it desktop application or be it web application so this is the introductory part of the c-sharp uh, programming language that what are those features and why it is being so much popular and how the what is the history behind c-sharp
please go through this so that you can have a clear understanding.